Hi there, how's it going? Today we are going to be watching a video about the Tucker Show. Basically, I saw the Sidemen do this on Simon Reacts. Go subscribe to them. At first, I was interested, but then like. It was years ago when this came out, but they're only reacting to now, but it got me interested because it looks fun. But I'm going to do, I didn't watch the whole video because then like, where's my reaction then? What I'm going to do is I'm going to be watching this and I'm going to be zip on so you can experience this as well. I'm probably going to get freaked out. You might, I don't know, but let's see how this goes. Apparently. There's the Tucker Zone 2. So if this video, I like I haven't even started anything, but if this video gets like, I don't know, five likes, give or take five likes, I'll do Tucker Zone 2. Well, at first, it says that you should wear earphones, not headphones. These are the only things I have. I don't have earphones at the moment. Whoops. And close your eyes and sit up. Sit up. Alright. I'm gonna do what the side men did. Yeah, an old mask. Pause the video right now and go get your headphones, earphones, whatever you got, something to cover your eyes, and experience it with me. To help you out, I'm not going to react or anything much to it, so that you can hear everything. Yeah. Let's get into it. Whew. Let's get on with the video. Please ensure your earphones are in and eyes are closed to experience the Tucker Zone. You unlock this door with the key of imagination. A fifth dimension, beyond which is known to man. As vast as space, as timeless as infinity. An area which we call... I'm your host, John Tucker. Tonight's episode calls for a special introduction, because in tonight's episode, you are the star. We're gonna do an experiment. An experiment to see if you can enter the deep vastness of your own imagination. Close your eyes, clear your brain, and take a deep breath as you enter. The Tucker Zone. Hey, looks like it worked. Welcome to the Tucker Zone. We're now inside your imagination, currently this vacant black deepness. But throughout this experience, we're going to explore places in your mind and slowly fill up this space with your thoughts. Let me show you what I mean. Every day our mind runs basically on one simple thing, water. I want you to think about what it would look and sound like if I had a water bottle in my hand right now. In fact, start to hear me shaking that water bottle, right by your right ear. Cool, right? You just made the water bottle a real thing just by thinking about it. Check this out. Farther. Now closer. How about around your head? Okay, we're done with this. I'll just uh, throw this back here. It's so crazy how everything around us was once just a thought somebody had, you know, just an idea. Then they put in the work and made it a real thing. Even really simple tools, like scissors. Tools like scissors help create the things we imagine. You know, they help in that process from going from just ideas to becoming real things. Okay, we're done with these two. I'll just uh, throw these back here. You know, all of this kind of depends on you interacting with your imagination. Let's try something. Imagine I have a balloon. You're getting really good. All right, I'm gonna put this balloon right here by your mouth and in a second, you're gonna blow this up. On the count of three, blow up the balloon. Like really physically blow it up with your mouth for this to work. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Too much, it popped. You have a powerful imagination. It can take you so many places. In fact, why are we just sitting here? Let's go somewhere. I'll take you there. Imagine yourself in the passenger seat of your car. Hey, you were supposed to imagine me in the car too, you know. Hey, come on, Lamborghini would have been nice. 
I'll drive. Let's roll down the windows. Let's get out. You know, sometimes things just pop into your imagination. You don't even know what you're Get that beat. Get that out of here. Remember, you're in control. You can ultimately make anything. Go ahead. Wait down. Get it out. Alright, how about some music? In fact, let's make it a party. You know, other people like myself can give you ideas that can then appear inside your own mind. For example, I'm gonna bring my robot. He's in the back seat. Behind me. Hello, humans. What's up, robot? God, that guy just pulled out right in front of me. Where'd he even come from? I can fix that. What? No. Where'd you get that drill? I have duct tape. I can fix anything. No, no. Put it away, robot. Nothing needs fixed. You know what? Let's just make one more stop here at this gas station. You have a long trip ahead of you. I hope you get prepared. All right. One more time. Imagine us all in the gas station. <laughs> Man, all this mind work can wear you out. Let me go over here and get an energy drink for us. You like Red Bull? Yeah, I do, actually. <sighs> Gotta refill your mind so you can control it, right? But hey, sometimes you just have to go off lot. Hey, you know what? Let's buy a scratch-off lottery ticket. See if we can win some money. I like money. Oh, I excuse me. Hey, can we get this one, please? $30. Okay, $30. So let's all split it, me, you, and my robot, and we each pay 10 Remember that in case we win. It was $30 total, so we each paid 10 Hey, don't answer that right now. Come on. Don't get distracted. You have to stay focused. You hear? All good? Yeah. All right, well, since you already had your eyes open, go ahead and scratch off the lottery ticket on your phone. That's like, open right. your eyes and check your phone screen. It's there. See if we won. Hello? Looks like we won five dollars. At least we got something back. Hey, make sure your eyes are closed again so we can redeem it. You know, we can't really split five dollars between the three of us, so how about we just each keep one dollar, and since we haven't bought this energy drink yet, we'll just buy this with the remaining two and share it. Cool? Sounds dope. <laughs> Alright. Speaking of money, you owe me for all this. <laughs> In fact, let's try one more thing. One more big thing before I go. Alright, are you ready? This is gonna be really cool, so pay really close attention. You have to remember, we're in your mind. I can even access some other places, like your memory. In fact, I could take a dollar out of your memory right now. Watch. Hey, you Hear that? Got it. This dollar bill actually came from your memory. Focus, and try to remember. Altogether, we originally paid $30 for the scratch-off ticket, right? $10 each. Then you scratch it off, and we won $5 back. Since we couldn't really split $5 between the three of us, we just each kept one. So basically, we each ended up losing $9. Nine times the three of us equals a total of $27 that we lost. Then we bought the energy drink with the other $2. Right. The other $2 from our win went to the energy drink. So 27 plus 2 equals 29. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Where's the other dollar? Right here. I took it straight out of your memory. Be careful who you lend your mind. You did awesome. Just with the power of your thought, you've made all this. Remember how powerful your imagination is. Live X. Do you. It's your turn to drive. You're in charge of your destination. Now enjoy the ride. <laughs> Keep going even when it gets rough. Remember, nothing is quite as it seems, gang. <laughs> Okay, that's it. Bruh. Bruh. Ah. All right. Ah. That was so unexpected. Everything felt so real. Oh. But hey. Wait a minute. He said I could open my eyes once. I didn't open my eyes at all. Did you open your eyes? Any point? Did you? Be honest. Right. Hope you experience this with me. Damn. I think I need to have a lie down.
So remember, if this video gets at least 5 likes, I'll do Tucker Zone 2. Go subscribe to Sidemen, go subscribe to these guys, and ah. Uh, also, do me a huge favor and go sub to my second channel. It only has two videos at the moment, and I haven't uploaded in a while, I'm sorry. But I've got a video coming on the way. I'll see you guys then. Please like and subscribe, and good hour. Bye.